What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do how they feel about you for somebody. Leo, what's up Leo? Sun, moon, rising or Venus. Thank you so much for being here. I'm not going to say that. Um, I'm getting this song in my head right now, but I don't even want to say it because it's very inappropriate. Um, but it definitely coincides with you, Leo. Like, who, who, no one else will get this song except you. <laughs> Maybe Scorpio, but I'm going to say it. It's Tasty by Danny Lay. I think that's how you say her name. Tasty. Someone thinks you're tasty, Leo. Okay, anyway, let's continue. Um, Someone rising or Venus. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day today. Let's see how they feel about you. Laugh and pull. So let's give me somebody from the summertime here that we're talking about. Um, somebody is not taking you serious. Okay, if somebody from the, from the summertime that you talk to or whatever is trying to come back, they're not going to take you serious. So be careful with that. Could be a Pisces. Doesn't have to be though. Or you can have that in your chart. All right, let's see. Been sitting here all day. <laughs> Some, somebody just can't stop thinking about you, bro. Sweet as creme brulee. <laughs> all right, let me stop. Bottom of the deck is how you feel. Family. <sighs> this could go two ways. This felt different. Okay, this could go two ways here. First one is you feel like your family is, you're willing to do anything for your family, okay? Um, <clears throat> even make the hard decisions that you know need to make here. This family is giving me, um, it's giving me like your childhood. Like it could be that, um, you don't want your family to end up like your how your childhood was. So you could be making the necessary changes and sacrifices that is required for you to make sure that that, that doesn't happen, right? And some of these decisions could be very tough for you. Now, for others of you, you there is going to be a love situation that's coming in or that is already here that's going to energetically this is a, this is a spiritual situation up in here it's going to energetically bring you closer to your family you guys could have been like deep down like wanting and yearning for your family like to be close to them again to be whole be as one and that is going to happen with someone coming in it's like you're going to automatically see like you, you the, the family's going to start like getting together or you know talking more or setting up you know whatever All right, first card you have is won't admit my wrongs. So this could be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or a Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. There's somebody here who is not wrong. This person is like, I'm not wrong. You're wrong. So you better you better check yourself before you wreck yourself. That's how this person feels. What is this? I'm tasty. <laughs> oh my gosh. King of Swords in reverse could definitely be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Ten of Wands is here with the Three of Cups in reverse. Um, this person <clears throat> feels like you're a liar. They feel like you are dragging out something that does not need to. You're making something a lot harder than it needs to be here. And they want, I don't know what I'm hearing. They want out with the Knight of Cups. I feel like they want to pursue something new, an, an opportunity. I feel like it's more for work, maybe. I don't know what this Ace of Pentacles here. But there's something that's more sustainable that they want to, but they know that you don't want them to do it. Like they know that they know that you don't want that and you are the only thing that's standing in their way. So they're about to go do it anyway. Or they already did it. And they're saying, I'm not wrong for it because this is what I want to do. Just because you don't want me to do it doesn't mean that I'm not going to do it. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just 
picking up this person's energy. Um, you can have kids with this person, or it could be somebody from your past here. <clears throat> They're gonna come and say sorry here. They are. But um I feel like they're going to give you hell before they before they do that. But this this is this is giving like you're right, but I'm not going to tell you that you're right until like until like you're at your breaking point. This person is very smart and um in the way that they try to manipulate you in the situation. It's like they know exactly what you like. They know they know how to um how to get you to give them equal give and take, how to get back on your good side. But they wait until the last possible minute to do so, so that whatever they do, even even if it's a little bit, it is a little bit with the Page of Pentacles. They don't do much. They don't even say much. The Page of Pentacles is the smallest suit of the whole deck. So they can they know that if they wait until you're about to lose it, and they come and they offer you this. It doesn't matter how small it is. You're still going to take it as a big thing because you have you you went through so much. That anything at this point would, would suffice. That's how they feel. This person? I don't know, um, Leo. I don't know. Could be a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, Leo, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right, or Aries, Leo, um, what? Not Aries, Leo, Sag, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. All right, then you have Pisces and school. This is not the same person as this. I don't know who this person is. It could be somebody who you met at school or work. I also got, <laughs> see, this person could be a Pisces, doesn't have to be. But this person feels like you're very intuitive. They feel like you're very understanding. They feel like you're very empathy here. They feel like you're very emotional. And they, the, they love that you're emotional, and the thing is that, Leo, you don't show this side. This person could be very intuitive. And it's like they know you on a deeper level than you think. Like this person could see right through you in a good way is what I'm getting. Um, it's going to be somebody who you've known since, since childhood. Okay. What is this Pisces and school? childhood friend what is this why are they here the two of pentacles the knight of pentacles and the magician this person is manifesting you here it's been a long time though this person it's been a minute the two of swords but they've decided I, they want to come towards what what does this person want with my leo Ten of Swords in reverse, the Fool, and the Eight of Pentacles. Could be an Aries. They want a new beginning here. It took them a long time. It took, it took them a long time to get over something. But they want they're they want to come put some work towards a connection with you here. They find out they they're gonna find out that you're in the same situation that, that they are in as well, that you let go of something, or this person's gonna come in when you once you let go of something. Let me see how you can know who this is. How will Leo know who this is? The star in birth. Could be an Aquarius. This is somebody who you lost faith in. Yeah, a disconnection happened here. Why? The truth came out. Somebody made a somebody made a somebody did not make a smart choice here. And it's like you had no choice but to move away. You're like, if that's what you're gonna do, if that's what you're gonna be involved in, I'ma go. You know what I'm saying? You decided to be out. So now this person's coming back. Okay, the tower in reverse. Um I honestly could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. I honestly don't know how to feel about this. So you're going to have to go with your intuition on that one, um, <laughs> Leo, because I don't, I feel very neutral. I don't feel bad vibes. I don't feel great vibes. It's just like, okay, we're going to have to see in the next video what, if this person is still there or what transpires if you decide to let, I also feel like the universe doesn't want me to say much either. 
All right, the next card is I will do anything you want. You deserve it. Somebody here wants to spoil you. Somebody here wants to give you something. Um, what is this? The world in reverse, the page of pentacles, and the nine of wands with the three of cups in reverse at the bottom of the deck. This person wants to come give you an apology here. The cycle isn't over with this person. This person has been going through it. With the nine of wands here, they've been going through it. Whether that's physically, mentally, emotionally. they if It feels like to them that they've been going through a war. And it's like they have this apology to give you. Or they have this something to give you here. But they haven't given it to you because they're still trying to get to you. Three of Cups in reverse. They have people around them that, that do not want them to come towards you. It could be an Aries, but they're going to break through. It's going gonna, it's gonna to happen out of nowhere here. For, for some of you, this person might come to you and like break down. Like crying um, or just reveal how unbalanced their life really is or how unbalanced they feel. Like this person is going to open up to you here on some deep-ish is what I feel. Like you, you're gonna, you're not gonna. It's like you're gonna be like, wow, like that's really how you feel. And I feel like this is what needed. This was what needed to happen in order for something to move forward. Because like somebody was holding this in, that they actually feel unbalanced, that their life is actually unbalanced. Um, and it was causing an imbalance in the relationship with you. But once this person opens up and lets you know what's going on with them, things start moving forward. Yeah, and it's like they let go of like. They let go of not having faith or hope in the situation. Because I feel like this person was losing a little bit of hope or faith. Or it could have been you. But it's because of the way things were moving. They weren't moving at a at a copacetic good energy, you know. Great. Right, but now they will be once somebody opens up. All right. All right, Leo. It's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this. And stay positive.